Yo guys, I want to talk about sniping in Apex. If you're new around here, then you don't know anything about me or my, my background, but I've sniped in every game I've ever played, whether that be Overwatch, Call of Duty, whatever, and I've always been good at it. I've always been able to pick up a sniper in any game and consistently hit my shots and do really well. Uh, the game you see in the background, uh, I'm going to be alternating through a bunch of different clips, but what you're seeing right now, I'm consistently hitting my shots, right? Shot after shot, whether it be body shots, headshots, whatever, but I'm not really getting any kills. So that's kind of what I want to talk about here. Right now, if you're unfamiliar, the weapon I'm using is called the Longbow. With the Longbow, you can get a mod called the Skull Piercer. The Skull Piercer mod increases damage done to headshots. The way headshot damage works in this game is dependent on the helmet that your enemy is wearing. So the rarer the helmet, the less damage you're going to deal on the headshot, right? So the first guy you saw me shoot, I dealt 138 damage, I believe. And the guy I just shot right now, he received 110 damage. So the headshot damage varies depending on what helmet you have. Now, in every game that I've ever played, if you are a really, really good sniper, you are consistently hitting your shots, you would be able to absolutely dominate. 100% just carry games, right? That's not the case with Apex. With Apex, you can consistently hit your shots and not necessarily get kills, right? Uh, sometimes you can, I guess, depending on the situation, whether, you know, what kind of armor they have, what kind of helmet they have. That's where the RNG comes in with the Battle Royales, right? It, it is what it is. But... For the most part, especially late game when, you know, the enemy team is right kitted and they're they're set up, they're in a good spot, you're not going to be able to just keep sniping, boom, 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 one after another and just absolutely destroy a team. That's not, that's not how it's going to work. Right now, the game is at a really early stage, right? The game just came out, so people are playing as if it's solo game for the most part. I know I am. I assume most every, everybody else is for the most part. But down the road, the, the way the game is going to end up turning out is it's going to be a really team-based game. People are going to build team comps. They're going to have actual strategies going into fights and stuff like that, right? That's what it's going to be long-term. And that's where sniping, in my opinion, is very, very fair in this. It's very fair. So this is a great example. You'll see right here, I'll get a headshot on this guy. There's the headshot. So then I tell my friend Chicken to get up there and get the kills, and he just cleans them up right super easy that's where sniping is super super good and that's the way sniping is meant to be in this game sniping isn't like overwatch or call of duty like the games that i played in the past where if you're consistently just dominating boom headshot 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 that doesn't that, that doesn't equal to kills and squad wipes right the only time that it does is if you manage to find the legendary sniper the 50 caliber now i've only found this sniper four times okay four times and all four times i've absolutely dominated so i'm going to play those clips in the background real quick this you don't get often this is the uh, equivalent to the mastiff right the the legendary shotgun so it does ridiculous amounts of damage i'm pretty sure regardless of the helmet you're wearing you still do 200 damage to the head so pretty ridiculous as you can see if i if i pick this thing up i'm sure that there's many other people out there too especially if you're a pc player where you just have ridiculous bonkers aim right uh, you would be able to consistently just wipe squads with this gun. Absolutely ridiculous. Even the body shot. Body shots do 125. So, for me and my channel, I absolutely love sniping. Like I said before, that's kind of what I've based my entire channel around is, is sniping in every game I've ever played. And I've been dying to pick up this gun and show you guys what I can do with it. But I've been super unlucky finding it. I've Like I said, I've only found it four times. But the gun is absolutely ridiculous. You're limited with ammo, it's very, very slow, so if you miss your shots, you're kind of you're kind of screwed. But if you hit your shots, man, you're going to absolutely dominate with this thing. Now that's kind of where the longbow, even the triple take, the triple take is the same way as the longbow. It's, it's, it's kind of underwhelming, but you can deal a lot of damage from far away, whether that equates to actual kills or not. You can actually help your team out and put out that DPS that your team needs to seal the deal, right? So like... Right here, you can see, obviously, I just want to go in for a... I was like, you know, I want to I want to sight the last guy up close, right? <laughs> but let's say, hypothetically, down the road when this game actually gets kind of competitive and people really learn how to build team comps and play the game, sniping is going to be like a long-range tickle thing, right? Like, you're going to try to deal damage, get rid of the enemy resources, shields, health kits, whatever, right? Like, that's what you're trying to do the whole time. That's where sniping is different in Apex to every game that I've ever played. Like I said before, sniping in Overwatch and Call of Duty, if you were good at it, you would absolutely dominate. Dominate with it, right? For the most part, you're not going to find a 50 cal. You're, the, you're probably going to be using either the Longbow or the Kraber. Technically, they consider the Scout a sniper too, but it's it's not. In, 
in my opinion, I, I don't classify it as a, as a sniper, but technically speaking, they do. But if you're rocking the longbow and you're rocking the triple take, chances are you're not going to get a ridiculous amount of kills with it. You're, you're going to do a lot of damage if you hit your shots, especially if you're hitting headshots. This is a great clip, for example. This one coming up, even though I'm just spinning around, shooting in the air. <laughs> we're trying to find the last team. They weren't pushing us. We were hiding. They were hiding. We were trying to find them. We couldn't find them. But as you can see, when they when they finally show themselves, there's nothing they can really do. It's just headshot after headshot. Bop, bop. And then the second guy, it was just the same thing. And there's nothing you can really do. Now, this is kind of where, you know, down the road, when people understand how sniping works in this game, they're obviously not going to be standing there. Let's say, hypothetically, this is a few months down the road. Uh, this video is uploaded like a week after release. But let's say, hypothetically, a couple months down the road, people start playing this game really seriously. They're building actual team comps. Sniping has a place where it's basically going to be like a deplenish the resources of the enemies, right? The more shots you hit, the more shields and health they're going to use, even if you're not getting kills. You know, it's it's benefiting your team, or if your team pushes and you're getting shots in, you know, it's just DPS. It's really good. You're not meant to one-shot everybody that you hit, and I'm completely okay with that now. But I'm going to add the rest of this gameplay to the end of this video because I've been super negative about sniping on stream, saying that it sucks and that I'm unhappy with it and blah, 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 blah. Basically contradict everything that I said at the beginning of this video. But I want to put it in there to, you know, show you guys that... I was wrong every time that I was talking about it on stream. I now realize sniping has its place. I'm okay with where it is. And I want to add it because I know that lots of other people feel the same way that I felt uh, in this game, for example. Okay? So, at the end of this game, I was hitting shots and I was upset. I'm like, snipers suck. Uh, sniping sucks. Why would you ever snipe? Blah, 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 blah. And others agreed with me. There's lots that agreed with me. And I just want to make it known that... I double back on all those comments, okay? I was wrong, and I do now realize that sniping does have a place, and it's it's not your typical one shot, one hit a quitter, you know, you hit a headshot, get a kill. It's not like that in this game. I realize that now, and I'm curious to know what you guys think. I know that most, well, everybody that subscribed to me beforehand, basically, uh, you know that yeah, you play the same games that I played. Sorry, that was like a weird stutter. But you played the same games I played. You played Widowmaker on Overwatch. You sniped on Call of Duty. You're used to getting one-hit kills, right? And you're not getting one-hit kills in this game. And I'm kind of curious to know what you guys think. Let's have a little discussion about it. Do you think sniping is fair? Do you think it's underwhelming, overpowered? Like, what, what do you guys think? I'm curious to know. We'll have a discussion in the comments. I'll be reading your comments. Trust me. Uh... Anyways, guys, like I said, I'm going to play with the rest of this game. I'll uh, put the in-game comms in so you can hear me whine and complain about how bad snipers are. <laughs> Even though they're not. Like I said, at the end of the video, I'm only adding it to show you guys that I was wrong. But anyways, that's where my mindset was. I hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video, and I'll see you on the next one. Come on. Found them. Where are they at? Oh, that way. Yeah. I messed up my job. Oh. I'll be there. Oh, I think they're inside. Well, that's a gosh darn it. I got the lifeline one shot, and I sniped the wraith once too. Unluckers, dude. That's why snipers suck. A body shot, body shot, and a headshot. Body shot and a headshot on him didn't kill him. A headshot on that guy after he was already hurt didn't kill him. Like, that's why the snipers suck in this game, man. Oh, I had to reload. I got him, chicken. There you go. This guy directly underneath you, right here. Oh, I don't have any uh, shield heals. I've only got two. You got a bird? A bunch grappled up on me. I sniped one. Chicken, gonna be behind you, bro. He's super hurt. 
He's gonna fall down. He's fell down. No, he's on the he's on the second level. Okay. I'm sneaking up on him. So I wanna no scope him. Give me shield stuff, please. Go. Aw. Oh, that was the last one. Oh, oh because I he had the uh, suppress. That's why snipers uh... suck in this game, man. But yeah, body shot, headshot that guy, headshot a different guy. I don't know. Unless you have the 50 cal, you just can't get like cool sniper clips. You are the Apex champions. Well, that's a gosh darn it.